So today I'm becoming a god and I'm gonna evolve humanity on a planet that's an entire desert. Ooh. That's the challenge I have for us today. This planet, we are gonna turn into a dusty, sandy planet. Ooh. I guess I don't really like sand. It's of course, irritating. It gets everywhere. Now, we could do fun things like pit vipers and guinea pigs, and how do we have all of these unlocked? I'm not entirely sure why they're unlocked, but let's go ahead and start making some desert up. So the base minimum that we need is three tiles to settle our humans on it. The miners are going to come over here, and I want you guys to settle right here. There you go, delicious little people. Get your little naked selves over and start building yourself up a nice little city. Oh, these guys really want to expand over there. Maybe I should give them an area to go. They're like, boss man, can you please give us some... Oh, wow. They can actually expand into the wasteland if they have nothing else. Interesting. Now, a miner has constructed the construction of a great workshop, which is kind of cool. And also, all of my plants and animals are now gone. Huh. Weird. Now we do have a tile over here for an animal booster, so let's plop in an animal. I kind of like the sand cats because they're cute and adorable. And they meow really nicely. Come on over here, ocean god. That's what you are. We don't get much use out of you today except for making animals. Because we're not making any oceans here. But put down the adorable little kitty cats. We want to play with them. Aww, there they are. They gave us some more biodiversity. And these kitty cats give us plus 20 income, so our city is going to start leveling up quite nicely. Now, another thing I want to do is put down, like, a gemstone here. So we can plop one of those in here. And as soon as I do that, we're going to get our first quest. There we go. A little more biodiversity. That's always good. A little more income coming over here. This city's going to level up, isn't it? Yeah, there we go. Aha. And now I knew it. The ranger would be here. Add an animal biotica to the borders. So we'll put in another animal. The only one we have available is the gerboa. Thankfully, we can put the gerboa next to the quartz, and it's going to give us some more income. There you go, little fella. They're kind of adorable, too. Look at their cool little hamster tails. Oh, no! Kitty cat! Stay away! <laughs> That guy just totally chased it down and ate it behind the rocks. So we're also going to collect that inspiration, which is going to be very solid for us because we're going to the desert. So if we draft up the desert, we can get other things. Date palm, ostriches. Okay, the ostriches take three of the biodiversity. We only really have two, but we can get bearded dragons. That's cool. I want that bearded dragon. We're also getting another quest, which I didn't really want quite yet. Oh, no, that quest is going back. So the next thing we're going to do is do the same thing, but with this city. Now, I'm going to leave some wasteland between them and give them about that much. There we go. Desert number two is being constructed. Look at that. I don't know why I made it significantly bigger, but let's expand this one a little bit, too. So the whole idea of the wasteland is that I don't want more nomads to settle there. So if I go over here a little bit, the nomads should settle. Here you come, friends. Plop down your beautiful city and instantly get clothing on. Oh, this is a place named Cactus Ford. That's like a name that I would make it. Also, why are there a bunch of warrior, like, Viking people? You're not supposed to be... Whatever. I'm not going to ask questions. Now, the same thing goes over here, except we have a food booster, which is Woo! awesome. We also have Jasper. If it's adjacent to a predator, I mean, that's super cool over here because that's a predator. But we do have that date palm and the date palm is great. So we're going to put one of these in here. Oh, not enough biodiversity for this biome. So this is a different biome and it was next to a gem and predator. So if I put in a predator, are you a predator? You are a predator. Oh, that's cool. All right, we want one of these. Hello, little bearded dragon. Welcome to your new biome. Yeah, there's some biodiversity popping up. All right, so these guys, they're just regular biodiversity. They like uh, undergrowth or element. Oh, now some people have left Wildboro. That's okay. We don't need them quite yet. Fellas, we don't have a city for you, but I'll make one over here in a little bit. Now, kind of an annoying thing is I need more biodiversity here so I can get these date palms. They require two, but I could put a withered shrub in over here and then build it. So we're going to risk it and put a withered shrub in. Also, can you imagine like being on a planet like one of these little humans and seeing these giant god things in the background just slugging around? Ta-da! The withered stuff. Great. So that should spawn a quest. An artist. What do you want? Uh, with a valuable yield. Okay. We could build a valuable yield. That's usually a uh, gemstone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is good. This is exactly what we need to. Come on over here, god number three, with your spiky shoulders. It's probably gout. 
If you're wondering, is a high a diet high in like fatty foods? I don't really know how gout's made, but whatever. We got artist skills, and that gives us more inspiration. Let's get a little more desert. A Gila monster lapis. Oh, we're gonna be enchanting some stuff or desert salt. My goodness, I don't know which one to go with. I mean, lapis is super cool. What about the other creatures? Okay, desert salt. We're getting mud crack. I kind of like mud crack. It gives us biodiversity, plus gazelles and olive trees. My goodness. Or, you know, topaz, lapis and topaz. We could go rich mode. And this over here is turquoise. Interesting. I kind of like the idea of having more of these. Let's inspect our desert itself. We have a chance to get really rich. So I think I'm going to take the Gila monster. Because these are five biodiversity and they're super expensive. Or is it Gila monster? I don't really know. I do really know that I want that date palm and I can afford it now. Excellent date palm. We have food and a little more biodiversity. Cool. So these guys are going to expand a little bit. We could expand this way, but I think it's time to set up that third city now. All right. We need to do the same thing. We do not want to touch because then they turn into the same biome and we, we lose out on points. Very nice. So I'll get you guys to settle over here. Where do I want you to settle? All right, in the middle. That'll be fine. Hmm, and it appears if our friends are going to build up a little bit more this way. So we have a couple more. Couple. Oh, never mind. They just came back from Magnus Patch in this way. Ooh, a Geo Booster. That's good, because we did just get this one. If adjacent to another gem. Huh. All right, did any of these good? If sets of a gem and Predator? Hmm. Okay, so we have Jasper already. So this would be a big benefit here. We could also start leveling these things up. I want to upgrade. Oh, wants to see the farmers and herders era feet. Good. And they made a caravan thing. Nice. So let's upgrade all of these. Really want to do the best I can just to waste my points. My bearded dragons are chilling too. I could actually put in the Gila monsters here. Now, did we need any of these to be next to a, bi uh, a barren biome? I don't think so. So you put in the Gila monsters next to this and we'll have two different um, gemstones. Oh no, 10 thingies left. It's okay. We're, we're not gonna get one of these points because they didn't give us the money point. The Gila monsters, yeah, they're adorable. So did you guys get the giant oasis created? They did, very cool. So we can start the same way. Did we get any bonuses? We didn't. All right, but having some desolate would be cool. So for that biodiversity, that's outside of the city limits. Sorry, I can't build there. We're so close to going into that next era too. This guy's just chilling with his withered shrubs. I would very much like to put a Jerboa over here too. We might get 15. Actually, let's check. How much food do we have here? We have five food. And this one, we have two. <laughs> we're, our food's not doing so hot. I mean, we are in the desert. That kind of makes sense. So we're not going to get that one and 10 of the science. We actually have nothing that really does that either. Usually the game gives like one quest for the money, but not today. I don't really know which one to place down. Maybe just a Jasper. But it gives more money if it's adjacent to a predator. We need to do one more thing in here so we can get a upgrade. How about just redstone? We're just going to build redstone. And we can replace that in the future. Ta-da! Cool. The time has come for a new era. We also are going to get a new quest. Hey, we got an S ranking. Hot dang, we did so good. Now we're going into the... Oh, that'd be fun. Aw, it'll be available in a later version of the game. That's the problem with playing with demos. I'll be honest, I'm fine with that. Let's just see what the artist has for us to do. One Biotica with a valuables yield. We're good at that. We can make valuable. I'll replace this redstone with it. Doink. Nice. Okay, and now we'll get our final desert update. The fennec. Ooh, we can make gold. A fennec. Man, that's cool. It also gives us other birds like a, a rattlesnake. Or we could get a desert tortoise. Or we could just get gold. Hmm. That does require five of the, uh, this thing. <laughs> I forget what that works. Let's reroll. Why not? Lapis. Again, reroll again. Desert ostriches or the gold. This one has gazelles. I like that. It also takes five. I'll reroll one more time. Okay, ostriches. I know some of you are mad because I didn't pick gold, but that's okay. 
I just really want ostriches. Okay, so the ostriches needs grazing if there's plants. Huh. So I could put you here. Let's do that. And is this expanded? It is. So if I open up... Okay, these guys are expanding that way. If I open up this one... Let's just try this. I'm going to open up the biome. Okay, I'm hoping that this city will expand over here. And then we can build ostriches. Uh-huh. For the chained empty slots. So if I put you right here... I don't have enough biodiversity. Or I do. Nice. We got ostriches. That's cool. All right. Ostriches want grazing. And they also want empty slots. So they need two more plants. And I can give them agave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> They're so happy that they got ostriches. Nice. Now they have one plant. And then they get the empty running space. So these things over here are still chained together. Wow, there's an ostrich over here. I didn't know that. I just guess they like to graze a little bit. Okay, and then this one, we need a chance for that one to an animal too. I guess I could put in, hmm, probably just a sand cat. There's a critter. Okay, these aren't critters. How about this one? We don't really have a big predator. Okay, so we'll switch out the shrubs with the gila monster. Neat. Yes, this makes it wild, so we get a benefit there. I also should be looking at these. Hmm. We could get the bronze planet pretty quickly. And then I totally do need to make... Go away. This, like, a withered shrub. Okay, and then that should help out you. Because we have more plant. Yes, plus desolate, grazing to two. Ah, oh, I could do one more. But I think that'll be fine. How are you guys doing? Are you growing? They have no desire to grow. I know one way to get them to grow. That's giving them more food. Or money. We can give more money. I think I'm just gonna do the burrow. We're gonna do this, and then we're gonna we're gonna give them a sand cat over here. Oh, and they they did already explore over here. Okay. So we can turn this into desert now. I wish you had expanded the other. Ooh, what is this? Look at that. A bonus super booster. Hey, the city just leveled up. It still has no desire to expand. So I'm going to put a date palm here. Nicely done. And the date palm wants gem and a predator. So I need to put a gem. And we'll give him a nice big gem. Like turquoise. And the turquoise also likes being next to something else. Yeah, that's a lot of money going back. I kind of want... I mean, I need to level up my foods for each adjacent gem or predator. So we have predator. We don't have a predator. That's empty. I could give him another predator here. That's going to level up the date palm tree again. And I need another gem over here. So I could give this like topaz. Here we go. That's going to be a super boost too. Nice. All right. That gave so much more food to the city. Great. Yeah, that's level 10 over here. Ooh, nice. We got a bronze planet. And we leveled up. That's perfect. Cool. And it looks like Wild Burrow has explored over here and has claimed this territory. So it's time to make this a desert. And I believe the entire planet's desert now. I also see no more inspiration. I was hoping we could get like one more quest somewhere, but it's not happening right now. So we have two more options for quest as well. The 30 food, we could try that. I feel like we could get another date palm. I can't expand the date palm that way anymore. I feel like the date palm is probably the best option for food. So is the agave though. I mean, if I change the agave to here, I think we could do that. I'm gonna try to put in a regular tree because that gives us 10 more technology. Cool. Yep, 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 yep. That'll work. And we got another one. <laughs> we're so low on the technology, though. I mean, we're in the desert. What do you expect? All right. Screw that. We're changing this thing over to a, uh, a agave plant. Maybe I should have put that agave into a date palm. Okay, I'm turning this dude into a burrow. Whoa. Where did my giant oasis food go way down? Oh, I didn't. It just went to the other. Huh. Weird. Now it's going back up. Okay, we'll put a burrow in here. Oh, I know why. Because these need empty area. Or I could totally get the wealthy one now. I don't know why it just gave me that quest, but it finally did. Okay, so these need to be chained. Can I re can I just straight up remove something? Yeah, delete it. Hey. I want to delete. Delete it. Get, it had the button. I saw it. Okay, so the sand cat, it counts as a baron, as an empty slot. I'll move this back. I might be able to get the wealthy globe. Yeah, there's a whole lot of money that just went in. Okay. Is that enough? We have a, an 11 here for income. This one is a 7. 11, 7, and 9. 11 plus 7. 
18 plus 9, 27. So we need three more, and I only have just a little bit more time. I feel like geodes are going to be the best way to go. So we have quartz here, and we could add quartz. We could probably add topaz to it, and then gem and predator. Okay, this actually is a good spot. And then I'll add quartz or topaz to this one. You can only do one thing at a time, though. So let's add topaz here. And we'll add quartz if we still have era. Oh, shoot. Okay, did we do it? Did we get the wealthy? Industry leveled up. Come on, get there. Ah, we had like 29, ah, 28. Shoot. Hey, well, we did it though. We managed to evolve an entire desert planet. And I got a C rank on the second stage. So, I mean, we did okay. I guess we would have got way better if we would have done a few more of the quests. But that's the challenge of living on a desert planet. Anyway, my friends, that'll do it for today's video of Rios 2. If you enjoyed it, go play the alpha demo. It's free on Steam. And keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. I'd like to thank all my patrons and channel members, including Auto Dave, Ben, Dicky J, Teddy Hippius, Ninjor, General Harris, Trent M, Kodino, Rit the Warrior, Keegan H, Zarnoff, Maxer, Ral, BC Engineer, Sakarsmarex. Spencer T, Whiskey, Endless Games, Splatter Sex, Doug Rules, Skunk Chess, Brad Dalton C, Scatterdy, Grayson, Elvora, Zane W, Kyle V, Mr. Triple One, Peyton Plays, Fussy Badge, Missing Sniper, Nolan, Kyler J, Pink Tiger, Jaden A, Mirage, and Nitrox.